Hello, and welcome to Brian Watches Rare Films. I'm your host, Brian, and you're watching Brian Watches Rare Films with me, Brian. How's that? Alright, so got an exciting new episode this week planned for you. I'm very excited. I am going to try to do this all in one shot, one take. Gonna try to say everything I need to say in the correct order uh, because uh, that way I won't have to edit it um, because it takes forever to edit these and it's really boring and I hate it. So uh, yeah, we'll see. I might have to edit a little bit because I'm sure I'll mess up once or twice, but I'm going to try my best. Okay, so uh, yeah, real excited about uh, this week's episode, but first um, let's do a question from you, the viewers. All right, answering questions here on my laptop. All right, so uh, this week's question, we got a question from Jason R. So Jason R wants to know, what, no new videos since 2019? Where you been, Brian? Uh, that is an excellent question, Jason. Thank you for your question. Uh, so, um, I think what Jason is talking about is I started this channel in 2019. I was posting some videos, watching some rare films, and uh, then I stopped. Nothing for uh, for two years, you know, and then, uh, then I started posting again earlier this year. So, um, in answer to your question, Jason, um, what happened was uh, where I live, there's a uh, pandemic going on. So, um, you know, you might have heard about it. It's affecting uh, several different areas, actually. So that pretty much just is, um, you know, messing up everything and, like, affecting everyone's lives and stuff. So, um, you know, it didn't really stop. It's not. It didn't stop me from watching movies or making videos or anything like that um, but I'm just using it as, as an excuse because like I don't know because I went to a hotel and they were like uh, they said that you can't have coffee I can't have coffee in the room and I gotta go buy it at the at the restaurant um, because of the pandemic they're like yeah no coffee because of the pandemic so everyone else is using that as an excuse so I am too um, even if it doesn't make sense but it's uh you know it's still going on this pandemic so uh you know if you are uh in one of the affected areas just um please make sure you're doing everything you need to do to be safe and not spread the virus uh you know um just do your part you know get your flu shot and uh you know wash your butt so um yeah so anyway we got uh we got that question out of the way. So what are we watching today? We're watching this movie, Freeze, Die, Come to Life, it's called. It's a Russian movie. I don't know much about it. My brother told me about it. He he randomly picked up a copy on VHS, I think at a thrift store or something. I don't know. But um, I'm excited about it. It's this black and white Russian movie made in, uh, made in, what's it called? Yeah, it's, it's made in the 90s, I think it was released. I forget exactly. But I'll, I'll put the link and everything. I'm pretty excited about it. Got good reviews. Pretty rare. Um, yeah, my brother has it on VHS, but I picked up this copy on its, uh, its DVD-R, which I think is where you order it, and then they just print it off on their computer or something. I paid, uh, I think, 16 or 18 bucks on eBay for it, plus shipping. Maybe that included shipping, I forget, but it came with two DVDs, and I, this is the same director, and looks like one of the same actors. I think this one's made a couple years later. It's called An Independent Life, and I believe these are sequels to each other, so I'll probably be watching this one eventually, but this is the the original, so I'm going to be watching this one today. Um, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, I'm all uh, bundled up today because... Uh, I want to get the full experience of this movie, so I'm, you know, I, I've had the AC blasting all all week just to get nice and cold in here, get it nice and cold, and um, it's pretty it's pretty cold right now anyway for for uh, Southern California, so yeah, got it nice and chilly in here, but I'm warm up, bundled up, and uh, you know, let's see, we got a healthy snack for today is. Um, 
I wanted to really get the experience, so I'm having, like, trying to have some Russian food, so this, like, mashed, um, mashed, mashed wheat cereal, it's cream of wheat, actually, is what it is, but I, I don't, I think that's American, probably not Russian, but it just, like, reminds me of, like, um, some mushy Russian food that the people in this movie might eat, um, so, you know, it's cream of wheat, it's, that's all I had, so anyway, uh, I haven't tasted it yet. It's hot. Mm. All right, so I mean, it's healthy, probably. Then, yeah, to get the full experience, I also made a hot beverage for a healthy beverage. Uh, this reminds me of like something some Russians might drink, and it is oh, it's black tea with um, heavy cream and stevia. So. All right, uh, let us watch this movie. I gotta unwrap it first, that's the best part, right? I'll take these gloves off. All right, how am I doing on time? I normally edit these so I can skip all the boring stuff, but I, I don't like to do that. Maybe I'll put this part in fast forward. It takes too long. All right. Uh, freeze, die, come to life. All right. Uh, the title. I like the title a lot. The um, this was just added for the the DVD for some reason. These things, but uh, the actual title is just "Freeze, Die, Come to Life" with no punctuation at all, which I think is nice. It's a nice title. We'll see if I like the movie, but yeah, cool title anyway. All right, so, all right, let's get ready. Let's, let's really get into the, uh, into the experience. Let's see if this stuff works. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I can feel it starting to work. Oh yeah, that's working good. It's working. It's working. Oh. Uh. That really works. All right, let's do it. Oh, crap. All right, so we just watched Freeze Die Come to Life, a rare film from Russia. Uh, I liked it. Kind of boring, not too long. I uh, 
I did as predicted. I liked the title more than I liked the movie itself, but that doesn't mean I didn't like the movie. This is a really great title, right? Um, so, uh, what was it about? So it's about um, these kids growing up in Russia in uh, in poverty, sort of. I just spit. I just spit. Oh, there it is. So, uh, I'll cream of wheat. Um, so yeah, it's a black and white. It was made in the 90s, but it seems like it was made longer ago before that. Like, uh, just the style. So it, it sort of makes you think that, uh, that, you know, they are a few, a few decades behind, um, the rest of the world, at least in this part of Russia where the movie takes place. So that was effective for that reason. So yeah, it's, uh, decent. I'll probably watch the, uh, sequel, uh, in Independent Life at some point. If it is a sequel, I think it's a sequel, but, uh, anyway, yeah, that's all I got. Um, uh, stay tuned. I'll see you again at some point. So, yeah. All right, cool. Bye.